No, seriously, whose idea was it to put these in college dorm rooms? Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Board From Dorm. On this episode, um, I wanted to do a little BuzzFeed quiz because um, I think it's interesting. Um, I, I came across this quiz and it says, it says, how Jersey are you? So, um, you know, being that I've grown up there my entire life, um, I would think I'm pretty Jersey and also my personality and um, so I thought it would just be kind of interesting to take this quiz because um, if I don't get Jersey, if I, if it says I'm not Jersey, um, that's going to be pretty funny because I've only lived there for, you know, 17 out of 20 years of my life, the other three being in college. So let's see if these buzz quizzes are actually accurate and um, yeah, let's get started. How Jersey are you? Let's go. So, you have strong opinions regarding pizza. True. Okay, Jersey, New York, um, best pizza. I can't seem to find any good pizza down here in DC. There's like one little sketchy shop that's open. Like, it's one of those like five in the morning to like seven in the morning shops and that's about it. Every other DC, every other DC pizza is like Domino's or Domino's or or cardboard. So yeah, Domino's. Um, you've eaten pizza for two meals in one day and weren't upset about it. Yes, I've definitely done that. You have a favorite bagel place. Yes. Also very hard to find here are bagels. Um, uh, they have some really, really good bagels. We are very particular about our bagels in New Jersey. So, um, so the bagels here are just like, I don't really want to get into it because I'm going to get very irritated, but um, they're just kind of really soft and I can't. You have a favorite deli, yes. You've been to a diner at an unreasonable hour. <laughs> I was like just talking about this. Yeah, there is a diner, I can picture it in my head and um, we used to go there at like three in the morning. Um, uh, just have some great hash browns. You know what Taylor ham is. No. You know what pork roll is. I think so. You know Taylor ham and pork roll are the same thing. No, so I guess I don't know what Taylor Ham is. You know what a ripper is. Oh my god, I'm not getting any of these questions, which starts to doubt my jerseyness. Oh my god, I'm starting. It's getting hot in here. You've eaten fat sandwich from the grease truckers at Rutgers. That that is a really specific question. Okay, I. You've called someone a shoe beat. Why have I never heard of any of these? You've been called a shoe beat. No. No, please, somebody call me a shoebie. You've called someone a Benny? And Benny's like capitalized? Is that like an anagram for something? You, you've called someone a Benny and knew what the acronym... Oh, did I say an anagram? What the, what the hell is an anagram? What the acronym stood for. This is like really depressing, guys. <laughs> to my defense, I have only lived in Jersey most of my life and most of it did not include college, so I'm just gonna say most of these are college related. You've had one dollar Bud Lights at the Parker House. No, I'm underage. You've had a friend who's had a summer share in, man, I can't even pronounce that. Manasquan or Belmar? Why are these so particular? You've had a summer share. No, I haven't had a summer share in Manasquan or Belmar, okay? You've gotten inappropriately drunk at the Osprey at Leggett's? Of Leggett's? Did they just like, did someone just Google map random places in New Jersey and then just be like, you've been there, you've been there, you haven't been there, you know someone who's been there. This is not Google Earth, like no, I haven't been to. You've done some things you regret at J Jenkinson's in Point Pleasant. I've been to Point Pleasant, does that count? No? Okay. You've taken too many shots at a tiki bar. Again, underage, I would never drink. You've tried to beat the clock at a at bar A. So someone clearly taking making this quiz was not New Jersey, or they just were from the shore, because half these questions are, you own a shore house, you're from the shore house, or you've been to these places near the shore house. Just because there was a show after us, called the Jersey Shore does not mean that was the only place that exists in New Jersey. Okay, people, okay, thank you. You've gotten hammered at, no, no. 
You've had a friend with a house on Long Beach Island. Yes, thank you God. I was going through a dry spell over there. You've been to Atlantic City for a bachelor or bachelorette party. So now we're getting, I see we're getting into demographics here. They're they're aiming for like the, at, at least 21, because a lot of these are drinking, to um, 25, 29 area, because um, a lot of your friends are getting married. So um, a lot of these questions don't even have to do with, you know, living close to the city or, yeah, all right, I, I see how it is. You've seen Bruce Spring, Springsteen at the Stone Pony. You've seen Bruce Springsteen at the Giant Stadium. You've seen Bruce Spring, Springsteen. Okay, well, literally five out of these like 50 questions, five to seven of them are um, Bruce Springsteen related. So um, yeah, there's uh, obviously no favoritism there. You've seen Bruce Springsteen out in the wild. You've met Bruce Springsteen. You are Bruce Springsteen. I'm like really, either I'm really letting down my state right now, or no, no, it's definitely not. No, whoever wrote this, no. You are not from Jersey. You have a drinking problem and you're really into Bruce Springsteen, okay? You've been to Hoboken at St. Pre St. Just, I, I, obviously I can't see, I'm not wearing my glasses right now, just don't judge. You've been to Hoboken Hoboken's St. Patrick's Day. Again, again, alcoholic. No, I haven't. You've gotten a public urination ticket in Hoboken during the St. Patrick's Day parade. You can kind of tell who wrote this quiz. They're an alcoholic that lives in Hoboken who uh, is really in love with Bruce Springsteen. So, you've walked past Carlos Bakery just to laugh at Star at Taurus. I mean, I know what Carlos Bakery is. I know he has a show, Buddy's Bakery. Um, I, I know it's in Hoboken and there's always a line out the door because he has a show, so. But it, and his cakes are really good if you're into dropping one to two grand on cakes. You've been to a Devil's game. I'm putting yes, because my brother has. You disowned the Nets when they moved to Brooklyn. Thank you! Yes, I did. Now Brooklyn has two teams. Jersey has zero, so um, thanks Nets. Thanks. Yeah, you're really committed to um, you know, the New Jersey Nets are really committed to New Jersey now that they live in Brooklyn. You have a shitty mall and a nice mall. <laughs> yeah, we do. Represent. You hated how the MTV show The Jersey Source stereotyped our beach communities. Thank you. Thank you. I think the other guy retired and someone took his position and now is writing actual Jersey things. You still watch The Jersey Store. You, in you still enjoyed. You still enjoyed? What do we I still enjoy? A little grammatically, whatever. Jersey, you know how to properly navigate a traffic circle. See, we don't really have many traffic circles in New Jersey. It's either, it's kind of annoying actually, because it's either you go one way down the highway or the other, and if you miss your exit, you're a lost cause, because there are no lefts in New Jersey, so. Sucks to suck, man. You sometimes forget Princeton University is in New Jersey. Yes, actually. <laughs> I know I shouldn't be contemplating this, but no. It's like the one good thing going for us. <laughs> You've hitchhiked over the GW Bridge to save money. No, I'd rather save my life and just pay a few extra bucks and hitchhike with some creep. But thanks for the offer. Spent a day doing weird New Jersey things. There's nothing to do in New Jersey unless weird New Jersey things is like going bowling and going to the movies. Then that's about all we have going for us. So You've eaten Portuguese food in the Ironbound section of Newark? Any Jersey people out there? Like, where are these questions coming from? Am I Jersey? Do you guys think I'm, oh, do we think I'm Jersey? Oh wow, 35 out of 100, it's less than half. Maybe you are from New Jersey, but you seriously need to get out more. Excuse yourself. I had no idea what a lot of these questions were, so um, I feel like a lot of these questions were from like South or Central Jersey. A lot of them were not about North Jersey. So there's, that's why I had a disadvantage. Let me know if you guys liked that video and um, and if I should do more quizzes, or if you guys liked it. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. I want to guarantee you someone who wrote this does not live in Jersey. I